the goddess Nut, the goddess of the sky, and the god Jed, the god of the air, okay? They had four children. The goddess Isis, and the god Osiris, and the goddess Nephthys, and the god Set, brothers and sisters. Isis loved Osiris, Nephthys loved Set, but Set he was loved Isis because Isis is more pretty and she was the goddess of the magic and the motherhood of the gods and goddesses. Set feel jealous from his brother. He want his sister to be his wife. What he can do? Just he can kill his brother to away him to get his sister and marry her. And he's dead. And he's cut, you know, the body of his brother, 15 pieces. And put in the coffin made of the wood and threw it to the Nile. The coffin moved from the south to the north because said he was a god of the desert. Okay? And his brother, he was help him to protect the king during the war. Okay, so the coffin is sailing from the south to the north until reach to the Mediterranean. And then the coffin start also keep it moved until reach to Lebanon. What's happened? Isis, she is take the form of the woman body and the wings bird and looking for her lover. She didn't find him here in Egypt. She thought maybe he will be in Lebanon because Lebanon, it was the second country of the god Osiris. She was very sad. She didn't find him in the city. So she went to the beach, the Mediterranean, and she was crying. And she's have a child and she feed the child because Isis, she was the goddess of the motherhood, the motherhood of the gods and goddesses. Then, what's happened? Accident, she's look and she's find the coffin on the beach of the Mediterranean. When she's open, she's find the body of her lover. Cut it for 15 pieces. And then she decided to back him to the life again. How? To make the council with the different gods and goddesses. For example, the god amun -Ra, the god of the sun, and the god Khonum, the god of creation, and the god Anubis, the jackal, the god of mummification. Okay? They collect the body again, restore it, and amun -Ra give the breath or the life again for this god. And he's back again to the life. He take his wife and back to Egypt, but this time they will stay in the north of Egypt and they will hide from their brother between the marshes until the goddess Isis to get birth. Because before Seth he killed his brother, already Isis and Osiris, you know, they married and they have a child. Anyway, Seth here, his brother, you know, he's back again to the life and he decided to collect his army and go to the north to find his brother again. And he's find him. And he's killed him the second time. But this time, he's cut the body of his brother, hundred, okay, of pieces. The story said the heart of the god Osiris found in the island, in Aswan. What this island? Fila. This is why Isis, she's built her temple in the Fila island. It was a, the island of the love, okay? And the head of the god Osiris found in Abydos. This is why also he is built his mortuary temple in this city. It was very, very important temple in ancient Egyptian time, okay? And his hands and the legs found in the different place in Egypt, in the four sides, in the west and the east, the north and the south. So this will be very difficult for Isis. She can collect the body of her lover and back him to the life again. This is why the god Osiris, after that he become the god of the dead or the master of the underworld.
and he was the very important god in ancient Egyptian time. Isis she's get birth and she's half her child. Who is this child? Horus, the falcon. This is what you can see over there. Okay? Horus, he decided to revenge from his uncle. His mother, she told him this story when he became strong and man. Okay? And he's collect his army and he's coming here to the south of Egypt. Where? In Edfu. Edfu, it was the land of the revenge. Horus, he will kill his uncle Seth until our next adventure.